Okay, my people, good, mo good morning or good afternoon or good evening. I'm here in the Catholic Church in Yavukoa. And a late, more later, I will show my face. But first, I'm going to enter the Church of Yavukoa if they let me in. I'm going to be quiet for a few minutes because in the church you're supposed to be quiet. You're supposed not to talk. Let me let me go inside my people. Look. Look at this church. Okay, my people, you saw that in the church, um, they have like uh, everything like wrapped on um, from the Virgin Maria, Jesus Christ, and they didn't, they, they, didn't, they don't let, I don't know why they don't let us see the Virgin Maria and all the, the things that they have inside. It is beautiful, but I don't know why they don't let us see this, 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 the inside of this place. My people, I'm going to say something about this church. I am a Catholic church person, and I'm going to criticize something about this church. This church is always, always closed. Today is um, Thursday. I don't know why they have it open because they never have this just open. They have it closed. Why? Why do they have it closed? This is the church. You know something? I have been in New York, and in New York, some church have twenty-four seven hour. 20 hours and 7 days open and here and here and, and this church this this church they open only, only some some time in this Catholic church I don't know why people do that here and my people I'm going to I'm going to show you something else okay this is the church of Catholic church and what I told you they ha this is a beautiful church, but they always have it closed, and I don't like that. Church should be, should be open every day. In Yabucoa, they don't do that. In Yabucoa, Puerto Rico, my friend. In Yabucoa, Puerto Rico. Okay, uh, let's keep on moving, my friend. I'm going to show you something else. 
I think they're going to make something here. I don't know what. This is the pharmacy of Feliciano here. Aquí tenemos la pharmacy of Feliciano. Mi gente, yo estaba hablando una cosa. La iglesia católica de Abucoa, y yo soy católico, siempre está cejada. Hoy está abierto. ¿Qué, lo que pasa? Tienen, tienen todos los santos, la Virgen y a Jesucristo tapados con, con, con pañuelos. No sé por qué lo hacen. No sé por qué hacen esas cosas. Y ahora, mi gente, vamos a mirar el pueblo de Yaucuba. Este pueblo, yo lo llamo el pueblo fantasma. ¿Tú sabes por qué el pueblo fantasma? Porque más de 20 años este pueblo estaba lleno de gente, había muchas fiestas y este pueblo ahora está vacío. ¿Usted sabe por qué? Porque el comercio se ha ido para otro lado y el pueblo de Yabucoa está completamente vacío. El pueblo fantasma, así se llama, yo llamo al pueblo de Yabucoa. Aquí tenemos algunos sitios, esto es como un club, esto es un sitio de, de me, un médico, doctora. Um, vamos a continuar. Aquí vemos, ok, I'm sorry, I'm, I forgot to say that and speak English. Here we have some place where they, they, they have some office of culture, art and tourism. I don't know what they have here. This is new for me. Uh, my people, once again, I was going. To, I'm, I'm, I was telling people that Yabucoa, I call it a ghost town. Yes, because in 20 years, this place was full of people, a lot of fun, a lot of West Town place to be, and this is is now a ghost town. Yabucoa is a ghost town right now. And look at this. You can see only only some few people here, but the truth is that they have they have this close almost every day. And I'm criticized what is happening here in Yabucoa. And every people from YouTube to know something about this place. Um, this is some famous people and this is the ph pharmacy Los, An Los Angeles. Okay, we have a, uh, a bank of called uh, Owen Tor. I have some money there, and we have people out here. Let's keep on moving, my people. This town, I really don't like this place. I don't like this town. I was born in Yabucoa, but Yabucoa need to be fixed. Have to make they have to do something here in Yabucoa. This is a, um, how you say that thing? This is like a, in Spanish we say, pueblo ensojado, a place that we don't have nothing. Only this town that is empty. Uh, uh, it, it's, uh, it's, it's day, it's morning right now. And can you see a lot of people here? No. Why? We have a, we have a new, we have a place to drink and have a good time there. And we have a place to doctor. Um, um, but that is the real thing of the Abukoa. Uh, I'm going to show you something. This plaza of, of Yabucoa. If you can see this, <laughs> believe it or not, this is a plaza they, 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 they um, um, sell vegetables. Look, it's empty. Gente, mira, mira, mira esto como está. Completamente vacío. Donde vende, donde vende fruta, vegetales, lo que sea. Esto está completamente vacío. Y luego dicen que yo hablo de más. La realidad es que el pueblo de Abu es un pueblo fantasma. Y hay que decir la verdad. And I'm talking the truth about the, 
of the time of Jehu Kor, I don't care who criticized me. Look, let's keep on moving. Okay, let's keep on looking at this town. The ghost town, like I call it. You can see? Empty. Store a closed. Just one open. A good place to be here. In a grand cafe. That's a good place to go. Uh, I have come here. I have been there. And I have buy some beer and have some fun with the people there. A good place to be. And this we have another another um, pharmacy pharmacy nueva new pharmacy they call it and my people are down there you can see a church you know the name of the church called six 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 believe it or not but I want to tell you something before I criticize the church. I want you guys to look in the Bible and tell me if this six 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 is in the Bible and they say that that's the number of the devil or the people invented that because people like to invent something in the in the Bible almost. Everything that they write in the Bible right now, not, I don't mean, I don't mean, I don't say, I'm not saying the old time. Right now, they, they're writing stuff that are not true about, 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 about um, the Bible. Um, let's keep on moving, my friend. Uh, como estaba. Diciendo en, en inglés, no, no, en español, en mi gente. Like, yo grabé una iglesia que se llama Número 666. Mi gente, buscan en la Biblia o en cualquier lugar donde diga, digan que 666 está escrito en la Biblia. Si está escrito en la Biblia, me mandan un like un comment o un share para yo saber si es cierto o no ok um, this is for the government of Yaukoa we pay the water and a lot of things here and, and we can take out some document that we need for maybe passport this is a, a church called Ministerio La Gracia de Jesucristo, a church. I don't know what uh, what kind of church it is because uh, it doesn't say the name. It, it's, not, it's not a Catholic church. Okay. I'm going to show you something here that I don't like. You see this place? You see this place right now? My people, they should be, should, they should buy, should, they should let, um, uh, have something cheap here, not, not expensive. All the things here to be cheap, cheap, barato in Spanish. You know something? Everything here is expensive, expensive. I don't know why they're doing this. Uh, let's keep on moving, my friend. Uh, here we have some place to buy, buy some mattress. You see it's in English. Mattress in Espanol. Okay, we are going on here. We are keep on moving. Um, and now here we have another church. This is a behind this. I don't know the name in, in, in Spanish. It's called. Una iglesia evangelista. Okay. This, this thing that you see here, I don't know why they did the, this. Why? why? Because it, it, they, don't, they don't use this. They, it's supposed to come water from here. And since they made it, 
I haven't seen water here in this place. And you can see another store that is open every day. Um, um, my people, um, this is a place called Bupen. Bupen is a place where we buy beer, we play games, casino game, and it's a great place to be. Uh, and here we have a pharmacy called Pharmacy La Hampla, and a place where people go to take care of themselves. And this is the and this is the Evangelist Church. Uh, here we can see on the flag of Puerto Rico. Okay, gracias, mi amigo. Uh, let's keep on moving my hand. This is the Bahamas Church. It's beautiful. I like it. And as you can see there, we can see a sign here that says that this is Iglesia Evangelica Unida de, de, de Puerto Rico. Welcome. And it's from Yaucoa. You can keep on saying this around here. I'm showing you the town of Puerto Rico, you know, uh, the town of Puerto Rico. Because I'm almost finishing with Yaucoa to go to another place. But I want to show you something else. I could be hit with a car, but I don't care. I want people to see the town of, of Yaucoa that is called a ghost town for me. I don't care what the media of Yaucoa say about this video. I'm saying the truth about Yaucoa. A mí no me importa lo que diga el alcalde de Yaucoa, que yo llamo este, este pueblo un pueblo fantasma. Pero es la realidad. Este pueblo había mucha gente y ahora no es nada, mi gente. Esto está completa vacío, completamente vacío. Look, let's keep on moving, my friend. This was the outer part, the closest to. Hello, my amigo. Hello, yeah. Hello. Fine, thanks. Okay, we, we have a trolley, trolley here, here in Yaukoa. A good thing here in Yaukoa first, first time. Then we have a place called La Puerta del Sueste, and we can see a big flag of Puerto Rico. Let's keep on moving, my friend. Let's try to. Move around. You can see this place. We have some some places here. Laboratory. Uh, we have something here like a like a church. Church of Yaucoa. Iglesia de Yaucoa. And you can see we can also see some. We can also see some a place where a mini market, uh, and we are going to see another place here. This is a beautiful place, and the people are nice here. Uh, this place is good, and these people like to cut hair. Great. Look at this. Um, my people, this is called, uh, let me see um, if I can see it well, because I cannot see. Um, it's a bar. Um, it was 2020, uh, a bar, barber house, 2020, where you, where you can cut your hair. We can, hear, we can see a laboratory here, and the gente, si yo me mirando a Pueblo de Yaucoa, down there you can see the police officer. I'm going to tell you something, and you will not believe this. Near, near, the station of the police officer. They killed like one or two men. Near the police officer department here in Yaukoa. What happened? Nothing. They didn't do nothing. <laughs> the policemen in Puerto Rico are doing nothing. You know why? Because we are out of police officer. Why? Because they're going, they're, they're leaving Puerto Rico and going to the United States. Because the United States, because the cost of life in Puerto Rico 
is too expensive. Too much expensive. I I saw in the newspaper what the 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 first uh, Latin American island that is so expensive is Puerto Rico. Believe it or not. Let look at this. Okay. Uh, okay. See this. Close, like everything is closed. We have a place called for to buy some furniture. And this is a person because uh, here in Puerto Yaucoa we have we, we make some cane sugar. That was about more than 20 years. But what happened? They shut down the fabric, and now we don't have a fabric here in Yaukoa making sugar. Yaukoa was number one making, making, making um, sugar in Puerto Rico. Mi gente, como vieron aquí, Puerto Rico, Yaukoa es el número uno en hacer azúcar en Yaukoa. Y se jaló. Y se jalaron todo, mi amigo. Se jalaron la fábrica, la fábrica de Yabucoa donde se hace este, los, la, 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 la azúcar en Yabucoa. Uh, people are going to keep on going up again. Uh, there was a, there was a uh, funerary, but they closed it. You know that what Yabucoa is getting, is getting bad every day. Yeah, see. Ah, I here we see some people, some good people. They're from Yogoa and and they are uh, good people. Su nombre? Ovado. Ovado. Ovado and the other? Arito. Okay. Um, este canal es en español e inglés y es a través de YouTube. Estoy hablando de. Estoy hablando primero del pueblo de Yogoa. Ok, estoy grabando todo relacionado con el pueblo de Yabucoa. Este, la verdad y la, y, la que, y la que no son verdad. Cosas buenas y cosas malas que han hecho aquí en Yabucoa. Yo lo critico, critico al alcalde y, no, y también no lo critico. ¿Por qué no lo critico? Porque yo me llevo bien con el alcalde de Yabucoa. Pero yo he notado muchas cosas en Yabucoa que es injusta. Ven las cajeteras bastante con hoyo. Dicen primero que eso le toca a la autoridad de carretera. La autoridad de carretera. ¿Por qué el alcalde de Yaucoa va a camino nuevo? ¿Y por qué camino usted con un montón de hoyos? ¿Por qué le cuesta al alcalde de Yaucoa tirar un pacho, un pacho en el pueblo de Yaucoa? ¿Qué le cuesta? ¿Qué le cuesta eso? Okay, hoyo, no, 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 Mucha gente del municipio trabajando, máquinas trabajando, todos los días. Lo digo porque lo, vi, lo he visto. La única playa que acá de Yaucoa arregla y limpia es Guayané. Camino Nuevo hecho, está hecho, la, la playa de Yaucoa está hecho una, está un desastre. No, no, acuérdate que todo esto, todo esto es... Entonces, el parque de pelota, la cancha, la cancha no, se, no, se la, la cancha, se, la cancha se puede arreglar porque la cancha no tiene una, 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 una malas condiciones, porque no, no la arreglan, no la arreglan. El, el, el parque de pelota sí va a estar bastante más, pero eso fue desde 2017, estamos en 2023. Y vuelvo a repito, como digo en inglés, somos ciudadanos americanos más de 120 años en Puerto Rico, ciudadanos americanos. Recibimos de Estados Unidos más de un montón de billones en la isla. ¿Y qué pasa con los billones 
en el gobierno. ¿Y qué pasa con los chavos en Yaucoa? Se lo da, se lo meten en los bolsillos. Y es la realidad. ¿Cuánto tú crees que cuaja tiempo va a ser ese partido? Como cinco años más. Sí. Si ahora mismo dijeron que, que ellos dañaron algo ahí y se lo están cobrando a FEMA y FEMA no quiere. Ah, un Sí, y fe. People, I'm, saying, I'm talking about, about what happened in Yawakoa. I'm sorry, I'm saying this in Spanish. But, uh, este, se, se supone que este, lo rompieron y FEMA no le queda dinero. ¿Cómo que llama eso que rompieron? Eso es verdad. Sí. Digo que FEMA dijo que no le va a dar más dinero. ¿Qué significa eso? Nos quedamos sin parque. Pero yo lo único que digo, ¿por qué la cancha que es más fácil arreglarla? ¿Por qué, la, por qué no la arreglan? ¿Tú sabes lo que, lo que me han dicho a mí? Que acá le quieres otra cancha en otro lugar. Gasta más dinero. ¿Por qué no lo gasta ahí? Se gasta menos dinero en un sitio del pueblo. Te voy a hacer una pregunta. ¿Qué hace la policía entonces aquí? Aquí, la policía, le, le digo la verdad. La policía sirve para meter tickets a la gente en la carretera. Eso es lo que sirve la policía aquí en Yaugó y en Puerto Rico. Meterle tickets a la gente en la carretera. Aquí hubo una muerte, dos muertes, cerca de cuartel de policía. Aquí cerca del municipio, cerca del de, de departamento de la, de la policía. A, a uno. ¿Y qué hicieron? Nada. Nada. Cerca de cuartel de policía de Yabucoa. Y yo aquí en YouTube digo todo lo que está pasando en, en todos los pueblos. ¿Ah? Yo lo subo, este, hoy lo subo por la noche. Eso lo, ten, lo tienen que buscar por un nombre que se, se dice Joseph Black. Black. Joseph Black. Black se escribe con V L O G S y Joseph es de José. No salimos en YouTube y eso en Instagram. En YouTube salen. Pero la realidad, yo no tengo nada en contra de la alcalde de Aucoa. No tengo en contra nada, pero siento en contra de que no ha hecho nada en Yaucoa. Ah. Mario Merende ya no. Mario Merende. No. No sé, fíjate. Que siempre llama a la misma, a tu juguito. O... Sé, sé que hay uno que sí que llama, sí, 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 sí sé quién es. Este, y otra cosa, me voy a decir una cosa. Este pueblo que tú ves aquí, este pueblo que tú ves aquí, más, más, más de 20 años parece un pueblo fantasma. Fantasma. Aquí, a, a, aquí en 20 años tú veías mucha juventud, mucha gente gozando. Digo, mucha gente gozando aquí en el pueblo de Yabucoa. Aquí se, se, se disfrutaba muchísimo. Más de 20 años aquí abandonado este pueblo. Un pueblo aquí no se sabe ni la hora que es. El pueblo de Yabucoa es un pueblo fantasma. Y aunque le tema a la calle de Yabucoa, pueblo fantasma, así que se llama. Y mi gente, eso es todo y gracias por escucharme. Ok, gracias a usted. Ok, my people. Um, those people that I was talking about here, they was telling me that what I'm telling you guys is true. Everything is true. They told me about what does the policemen, all the policemen here in Yauco, in Puerto Rico do. You know what I, I told them? They only give some ticket to the people in, in the street. But when they have to solve a crime, they don't, they don't do nothing. They, they forget that they have, they have um, some children, they have some family, and then they forget about those people that, peop that there are people dead in the street, and they forget all of those, about those people. And, and this is the truth of my, my town of Yaucoa. And like I told you, when I was talking Spanish with those people, those people told me 
that, that I was telling the truth about the town of Jabucoa, Puerto Rico. And I'm sorry if people here in Yabucoa feel bad about this video, but I want to tell you something, my friend. This is the real life. This is the real life of Puerto Rico. And everything is expensive. A lot of hole in the street, montón de pollo en la carretera, todo es carísimo. Este, la policía solamente sirve para hacer tickets, no sirve para, para trabajar con los criminales, le tienen miedo a los criminales, solamente le meten tickets a la gente inocente, gente buena, para que vean cómo es la como es la policía en todo Puerto Rico y mi gente sigo grabando porque quiero seguir enseñándole un poco más de mi pueblo porque ya estoy a punto de terminar el pueblo de Yaucoa para irme para otro lado en Spanish my people English English I'm sorry I'm, in, I'm trying to finish this place called Yabucoa because I'm going to another town, another town. It could be the old San Juan. I love San Juan. It could be another place. Well, we could have seven, eight town. <laughs> seven, eight town and seven, eight um, po politicians co-opted him in Puerto Rico. And that's the two of them. This is, this is the two of Yabucó, uh, Puerto Rico. Not Yabucó, Puerto Rico. And I told you before, the island, the Caribbean, the Latin American, the most expensive is, is Puerto Rico. If you look at the news, if you look at the news, you will see that in Latin America, the most expensive, I, expensive place is Puerto Rico. And that's the truth. I saw it in the news. And you can look in the news. And this is true, my people. And look, look at this. I, I don't know why, why, why the mayor of Yokoa wrote city with an S. No, he, he, he have a, a, an excuse. He said that it's, it's the name of something that they write, write the city because the name of something. But dude, that, that should be city with a C, that with an S. <laughs> but, uh, but every time, every time I see, I see everything here, <laughs> very bad. This is, this is a great place to be. I like to be here. And this is a, a, a doctor. And like I told you he, he, I told you before, we have a pharmacy, we have a place to bakery to buy to cake, um, candy and bread and more. And let me keep on saying this. We already saw it, but I'm 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 returning back. Here we have a kind of bubble shop, a place that I have gone before. And it, they are a good person too, good people. They cut hair very well, good. I like what, I like what they do, they have. And keep on moving. Uh, oh, I have, to, I have to say something to you, like you, to you people. There are a lot, there are a lot a house in Yabucoa that are empty. There are a lot of houses in Yabucoa that are empty. People are going to, to the United States of America. Why? Because this place, Puerto Rico is a place of, is so expensive that nobody wants to live in Puerto Rico. Or Puerto Rican want to go to the United States to live. And that's the truth, man. That's the truth, man. You know, you know something else? When you go to a supermarket, 
or anything. Um, when when you buy something, they give you a bag to put the product, productos in Spanish, and the bag costs you 10 cents. And then the, the income, income tax here in Puerto Rico, they talk about United States, but they don't talk about what is happening here in Puerto Rico. Mi gente, le voy a decir una cosa. Aquí habla mucho de que que si, que no, si nos convertimos en Estado o no, que si todo lo otro. Pero voy a decir una cosa. Cuando, en Estados Unidos, en Nueva York, no se, no se vende las bolsas de, para, para meter, meter la, la mercancía, los productos. Aquí en Puerto Rico sí. Aquí pagamos impuestos en el pueblo y en el gobierno. Aquí, aquí todo es impuesto, impuesto, impuesto. Entonces, ¿por qué critican mucho el Estado 51 en, en, para Puerto Rico? ¿Por qué lo critican? Maybe I, I want to say something. Maybe, maybe you would not like this, but I want to say it. They don't want some people, independent people, and some other people. They don't want, they don't want Puerto Rico to become a, a 51 state. But you know why? Because the income tax. But you know, you know that we pay a lot income tax here in Puerto Rico? Everywhere, in any place, the income tax in the city, in the, in the government, in, in the stores, every place we, we, we have to be done. And, and we have to um, waste money, give money for income tax. And this is in Puerto Rico. And they don't want Puerto Rico to become a, a 51 state. Puerto Rico can be what they, what they want to. I don't care if they want to be a 51 state. I don't care if they want independent. But I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you the truth. Puerto Rico never will never become an independent island. There's a lot of people of statehood and other um, and our politicians that want Puerto Rico to stay like it, like it is right now. Uh, let me see something before going. I want to see something. I don't know where it is, but I want to see something here. I saw something here that was, it was wonderful. Um, let me keep on moving. Let keep it. Vamos a seguir moviendo. Mi gente, todo lo que dije, la verdad. Vamos a ver una cosa aquí. Let's look something here. Okay, we can see this place. Uh, we can see this place. The clean, the clean this place. You can see around here. Okay, my people, to finish this video, um, I want to say have a great day, afternoon, or evening to everybody. God bless you all, wherever you are, any country you are, and always believe in God. God will help you in Spanish. Mi gente, para terminar, que Dios los bendiga, este, cuídense mucho, mucha salud para todos, bendiciones, que nada malo le pase a nadie, que todo, todos los países estén en paz y que todos los países, Dios los bendiga a todos los países en Puerto Rico. ¿Por qué? Porque nuestro Señor... Nuestro Señor Jesucristo, nuestro Señor Jesucristo nos va a ayudar. And, para terminar, I didn't show my face. Para terminar, no, no enseñé mi cara. Dame presentar mi cara. Es, fe, es fea, pero tengo que presentarla. Okay.
Okay, my name is Joseph Doug, and I'm going to finish this video of the song of Yaukoa. My name is Joseph, Joseph Doug, so you might be there. Y voy a terminar con el video este, de este pueblo de Yaukoa, un pueblo que está, que parece un pueblo fantasma, mi gente. Okay, and and let me let, let me finish this saying goodbye to everybody. And I, I I miss you guys. I don't make too much video, but I'm going to make video from from in other places. Maybe I will make two more videos of Yabukoa. Maybe two more. Because I need to make Two, place, two places that I haven't gone. And I want to sh show you something, ha what is happening in Yaukua, and why this town is called Ghost Town. Okay, my people, see you. Have a great day. God bless you. Bye-bye. Adios. Sayonara, my friend. Adios. Goodbye.